Being a monarch throughout history must have been pretty hard. And in response to this idea, we here at the Nomad History Channel decided to make a little sketch based around what if there was an interdimensional time-traveling infomercial program that contacted monarchs and gave them advice on how to rule. Here's the sketch. Hope you enjoy. Hey there! Welcome to the Rex Network, the only network that helps monarchs with all their problems throughout all of history. Boldacious! So, a lot of you monarchs have been asking us, hey, I still want to be in control of my kingdom, but I'm having a lot of difficulty with actually being the monarch of my land and being, you know, contested all the time. Like, my nobles are telling me, oh, you need to do this, you need to do that, I'm gonna kill you, I think I would be a better ruler. We completely understand. A very common problem throughout history. And we've been searching throughout history to find a perfect solution for you. And we think we found it. All the way from the east. From the Empire of Japan. We call this particular solution the Emperor Shirakawa Method. Basically, like our friend Emperor Shirakawa here, you retire from being the emperor and go live in a monastery of your choosing. You know, if you're a western monarch you may want to go find a church to live in. Or, in our friend Shirakawa's case, you go live with some Buddhist monks. If your nobles and enemies are self-respecting, they will not attack a religious institution. Radical! Now, that part's easy. But don't forget, before you leave, you need to leave behind a successor. But, this is the crucial thing, you need to make sure that this successor is pliable and easily manipulated. You know, preferably young, like an infant. You're the boss, baby! And you install this little codger on the throne, and then, from your Buddhist monastery, you get a close contact of yours to be your representative in the court. And basically, you tell that little guy what to do. S -s 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 -sweet. Meaning that this person gets to be the king, queen, emperor of whatever land, while you, you get to keep the control. But you also have the security of your monastery. So easy, but bonkers! That was a free tip for all our paying subscribers. We hope you enjoyed this installment of the Rex Network. Next time, We'll be telling all you hopeful monarchs how to be a king, or queen, or emperor without having to use the title, but still having legitimacy. And if you're new to the channel, hey, welcome. Please pay us all your gold. <laughs> Please, pay us. It's, it's hard broadcasting this throughout all of history. See ya. Subscribe to the Rex Network. <laughs> Hey, uh, if you enjoyed this little sketch, um, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you like the sketch style videos, we might do more of those. Thank you very much.